absolute most joy every morning is my cup of coffee. Good morning! Happy Vlogmas day one. I'm so excited. Now listen, I know last time we spoke, I said that I was gonna take a break until I started vlogging for Vlogmas on December 1st. And well, today is November 27th. <laughs> And the truth is, I honestly missed you. I missed you. I missed vlogging. I love vlogging. I really do. I've also just been dying to get a Christmas tree, ready to decorate, ready to get the festive vibes going in the house. And I don't wanna wait till December 1st to do that. I wanna do it today. It's a gloomy Sunday. I was in a little bit of a funk yesterday and I feel like decorating and getting in the holiday spirit would just lift my spirits and make me feel good. Plus I always love hanging out with you. And then I also was reading through some of your comments on my last video and at least one of you suggested that I pre-film a little bit for Vlogmas because I think I had alluded to the fact that I was like slightly, not concerned, but anxious maybe about putting 25 videos out in 25 days. That's a lot, I've never done that before. And at first, when I thought about pre-filming, I was like, isn't that cheating? I feel like I'm supposed to vlog every day in December. But after further thought and further, have I literally just forgotten the word? The word literally escaped me. What was I? research <laughs> and after further research i realized that there aren't necessarily rules other than putting 25 videos out in 25 days the first through the 25th of december so i figured i have the day off today i have the itch to decorate i miss you i want to hang out with you so why not just start vlogmas day one today that way too i feel like once i get into it a little bit if there's a day where things are just hectic where i'm just not in the mood to make a video then i won't miss a day so anyway <laughs> got some decorations from target i got a tree skirt which i'll show you in a little bit i got two little sweaters for the dogs oh my god they're really cute which are gonna match some holiday jammies that i got myself and i also got my mom a matching pair i hope that she's not watching right now because she's not gonna get hers until she gets here i'm so bad at keeping secrets i'm literally so bad at keeping secrets i just like love gift giving and i get really excited <laughs> Anyway, hopefully my mom's not watching this. They also got a tree topper. I have no idea if this is gonna be too big because I really haven't decided how big of a tree I'm gonna get. I'm not, don't think I'm gonna get like a massive tree, but like, yeah, I don't know. I don't know about like the arrangement that we're gonna be doing in here. We're gonna have to sort that out. Uh, tree topper. I got some gold and cream, very aesthetic ornaments, which I'm very excited about. I also cannot believe the amount of self-control that I was able to exercise by not lighting the holiday candles that I got at that wreath making class, which sadly, speaking of that gorgeous wreath that I made, I think it's mostly meant to be hung outdoors. I did hang it in here and every day there was just a pile of wreath on the ground. <laughs> I think because like I'm not able to water it, you know, and it's just essentially slowly dying, which is kind of sad. Yeah, I had to rehome the wreath, which is really sad, but that's okay. Still have the lovely holiday candles that I got from that event. What else did I get? I feel like I got something else. Oh yeah, I got Christmas lights. Hold on, let me get those. I also got Christmas lights. Hopefully that's enough. I have, no I do. I might have to order more. I got a little light up sign, maybe from my shelf. I also ordered some garland for my media console, but that did not come yet. So maybe it'll come today, I don't know. Oh, I thought I got, it did not get garland, but that's okay. We can still get some later. I also got the dogs, these sweaters too. From Target, aren't these cute? So, so cute. It's getting chilly here, you guys. It's, it's actually not too cold here today. It's like, I wanna say, yeah, it's like 50 today. So it's nice today, but there were a couple days there last weekend that it was really chilly. It was like 30 and I was like, okay, it's happening, it's happening. Anyway, I also got some fun stuff for us to do through Vlogmas. A little advent calendar. I actually bought an advent calendar and then it was gifted one, which we'll get into later. And yesterday I came up with like a workout plan for myself in December, which I think I mentioned to you that I wanted to do possibly during Vlogmas. So I'm going to share that with you later too. I feel like there's just like so much I want to tell you, so much I want to do with you today. <laughs> okay, yeah, I haven't vlogged in a week. That just feels like a lifetime. It just doesn't feel right. I missed you guys. In addition, 
relation to all of that, I also want to go to the grocery store today and stock up for the week because I have been eating Thanksgiving food for breakfast, lunch, and dinner the last few days. And I think, I think I'm done. I'm done. I want a salad. <laughs> Let's go pick out our Christmas tree. I'm so excited. I know that there is a Christmas tree lot. I also noticed that in New York, they literally sell Christmas trees just on the street, which in Orange County and LA where I grew up my entire life, that is just not something that I'm used to. Like you have to actually like drive to a specific tree lot, but I guess in New York City, they just sell trees on the street, which is seriously so cute and festive. So let's walk around figure out where we're gonna get our tree from. And go pick out our Christmas tree. Little side by side. Oh yeah, these actually are really nice. They're a little more even than he is, huh? You gotta call his front and spin this in here. Actually, that's the front. Yeah. Yeah. What do you think? This one does have really good shape to it. Will these come down a little yeah, bit, you think? Will, yeah, what kind of tree is this again? This is a Fraser fir. Fraser fir. Or, you know, keep the old West Coast roots. No, no, no. <laughs> We're going East Coast. We're going East Coast. Okay. Yeah, let's do that one. That one's cute. Yeah, thank you. Good choice. Yay, I'm so excited. We got our tree and you can add this to the list of random oversized heavy things that I've carried down the street <laughs> in New York City. I'm thinking that I should put this plant in my bedroom and we'll put the tree here and maybe I'll put the plant in my bedroom over here for December. I think that's a good move. We need holiday music for this. <laughs> Okay, that will have to do for now. Time for the tree. Oh my gosh, it looks perfect in this little nook. I'm so happy with it. It's adorable. Let the decorating begin. slightly confused because I tested all the lights, they're brand new, before I wrapped them in the tree. And then halfway down, I looked down and half of the first strand seems to be broken, which is a little strange. I don't know what happened. I just checked every single light and I can't seem to figure out the problem. So, uh, more on that later. This is a very interesting thing we have going here. Honestly, this is a little long for me. Don't know if we can try and trim it. She's looking good. So I think for now, although actually I might add like one more, one or two more little balls right there actually. I have decided that I definitely do want to get a few more decorations. So I think I might order those today. I do want to get garland for the top of my media console. And I do want to add some colorful, fun, special ornaments from maybe any Christmas markets that I go to this month. Yeah, I feel like the tree needs a little bit more pizzazz, but that's to come. This is just day one of decor, you know? The only thing about the tree being in this corner is that I can't really film in front of it, which is kind of sad, <laughs> you know, because, well, at night we can 
film this way just because the light is all coming from this way and it's just like the lights like not great this way as you can see um but that's okay <laughs> this is this spot makes the most sense for it i want to figure out where i'm gonna put my little mary sign and then i probably should eat something because it's most likely after one o'clock oh and it's pouring rain out i just got really sidetracked with decorating the tree and i'm like suddenly starving you know what i think i might do i think i might order some food because i do not want to go out in the pouring rain carrying bags and bags of groceries and i also kind of don't want to stop decorating right now <laughs> i'm gonna order lunch and then let's figure out what else we need decor wise and figure out where to put that little sign you guys just nice and cozy Had some leftover ornament ball things and i can't tell if this is like cute or weird but i'm gonna live with it for a little bit you know as i do i feel like it's kind of cute kind of ties in the tree i don't know could be strange <laughs> this christmas wish candle just is like heavenly this is going on at the coffee table for sure <laughs> I ordered some food from Jack's wife, Frida, and it came a little bit ago. And as I said to you before, like I don't wanna eat any more of my Thanksgiving food, which is literally green bean casserole, mashed potatoes, stuffing, sweet potatoes. It, it's delicious. I've just had it for a few days straight, which just feels like potatoes four ways. And I'm just done, you know? And I told you, I want a salad. And I did order a salad. And I ordered some sauteed kale and tofu maybe for dinner, just because I'm not planning on like leaving the house, which are great choices, right? Really great choices, super excited about this. And then at the last minute, I went rogue. And I ordered French fries as well. Like as if I, as if I need more potatoes. Cause I've just literally, I feel like a potato today. And look, I love potatoes. I just, I've been eating potatoes for like, what, four days straight now. And guess what I did? I proceeded to eat all the fries while I continued to clean up and decorate. And now I'm too full to eat my salad or my kale and tofu, which is just like, why did I do that? Why? I don't know why I did that. And look, I have no hate for french fries. I'm a big french fry girly. I'm just wondering why. Why? Why am I eating more potatoes? Oh. I got some PR from Redken. How cute is this box? It is their new acidic bonding concentrate, shampoo and conditioner, leave-in conditioner, and intensive treatment. Thank you so, so much. I actually use a blonding slash purple shampoo from Redken and I really like it so much. So I'm excited to try this. Ma'am, this one needs all the attention. That one is the good independent girl. What do you need? What do you need? I can't, I'm not gonna take you out right this second. You know why? It's raining. It's raining out. You're not gonna wanna go, trust me. You don't like the rain. I don't like that. Very excited to try this stuff out. Now, advent calendars. I wanted to do an advent calendar with you guys. I really wanted to start it on December 1st, but I guess I'll do it in order of Vlogmas vlogs, like so we can do it together. I got myself one and then a brand sent me one. I'm still trying to decide if I wanna keep this one. It's a tea. I'm not a huge tea drinker, but the tea that I do drink, pretty much like the same tea, which is either sleepy time tea or peppermint tea. Yeah, I don't drink a ton of other types of tea other than matcha. This is actual like herbal tea. Maybe I'll become a tea drinker. Anyway, so I thought it would be fun if we did an advent calendar together, but I have two advent calendars for myself now because I have a tea one, <laughs> which we'll open in a minute. And then Rituals sent me this one, which is massive. And I'm pretty sure this is 
beauty products and I don't know what else is in there. It's gonna be so, so fun. We'll have two advent calendars to do, which I was already planning on doing because I also got the dogs advent calendars. They had these at Trader Joe's and I was like, okay, yeah, these are so cute. So we're just gonna be doing multiple advent calendars. Love that for us. You can open one every day till Christmas and I got one for each of you, okay? So let's do number one. Wow. This one's for Penny. No, this one's for Penny first. Big girl first. No, you wait. Good girl, Penny. Okay, Bali, your turn. Let's open yours. Come here. Okay. Let's show them your tricks that you can do. Go circle. High five. Good job. Sit down. Four. Good girl, sit. Good girl. Just thought these were so cute for them. They have to participate too, you know? Am I like cheating by opening this early? So this is why like vlogging for Vlogmas before December is very confusing for me. <laughs> and it's really messing with my morals because I'm like, I wanna be honest and I wanna like count down, but then I'm also like, I don't know. We're just gonna, I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna think about it. It's just Vlogmas, it's just an advent calendar. Here's number one. So sorry, but I cannot pronounce that. <laughs> Green tea, almond. I can't have almonds. <laughs> oh no, I hope they don't all have almonds in them. Uh, okay, I unfortunately cannot have this one because almonds make me break out. So I don't think I'm allergic, but I just don't even like to mess with them. So I will maybe pop this in a gift for somebody. Sounds really good. We'll try again next vlog. I am very keen to open this one though. Oh my gosh, how fun. Okay, this looks really cute. Oh my gosh, wait, you set the whole thing up? Where would I put this? I don't have a ton of space in this New York City apartment and I have actually a big apartment when it comes to New York City, but I don't have a ton of space. You know what actually we could do? We could hang them on the tree. I know I just said I wasn't gonna build this, but I just tried to hang some of these on the tree and some of them are too heavy for my little branches. Blew out our candles because I am gonna go down to the gym, but let's open day one from our rituals advent calendar. It's a little candle. Suede vanilla. Oh my gosh, that smells amazing. Like I really needed one more candle, but honestly this would be perfect for in the bathroom, like when I'm taking a bath, I love that. I need to attempt to walk the dogs outside even though it looks like it's pouring rain out and then I wanna go to the gym. And when we get down to the gym, I will tell you about my workout plan for December. <laughs> gonna do 12 3 30 on the treadmill she brought my little journal down with me and took some time yesterday to write out my workouts and essentially my plan right now is to do two to three yoga classes per week one rise nation class which is straight cardio it's a versa climber workout that's roughly 30 minutes and then i'll do two days here in my gym one heavy lifting day so heavier weights less reps really focusing on targeting certain muscle groups and then one other day that i'll do like a full body berry style workout so i'll do half sprints and running on the treadmill and then half higher reps lower weight high intensity interval training style workout i don't want to really share too much more about it at this point in time because i haven't actually done it at all i've just written it out and so i kind of want to get into it see how it goes see how i feel before i share any specifics but maybe if you're into it comment below in a future video maybe i'll share one of my workouts that i do here in the gym just like kind of wrote out a full workout for myself and i wrote out a heavy day and that kind of stuff so i'm gonna try that out for the first week of December and see how it goes and I will let you know. But for now, it's time for 12, 3.30. Also, this set was gifted to me by Free People Movement and I love it. I feel like it is light colored. I don't know if it's see-through or not. So that's why I have this tied around my bum just in case I sweat. But it is the seamless material that I love so, so much. And I will link it below for you.
hop in the shower, but I wanted to show you a few things that I got from Amazon because I just picked up a package from downstairs. The first thing I got was this thermal spring water facial spray. I heard it's very good for sensitive skin and my skin has been so dry since the change of seasons. So I'm just gonna kind of keep this out where I can see it during the day and refresh my face. I also got another Panoxyl face wash. If salicylic acid doesn't work for you, if you are acne prone, try benzoyl peroxide. I am definitely a benzoyl girl through and through. This stuff is pretty harsh and intense, so I don't use it all the time, but when I have active breakouts, I love this stuff. It's amazing. I will link everything below, by the way. And then I also got this little gift set on Amazon. I think it was like a Black Friday special by Elemis. It is cleansing balm makeup remover. So I've been hearing a lot about using cleansing balm to remove your makeup and then washing with a face wash after just to remove all of the makeup and like dead skin and all that stuff because I have been using basically reusable makeup remover rounds for years and that's how I've been removing my makeup. I don't really wear a ton of makeup, but I thought that perhaps when I'm washing my face, I'm not getting all my makeup off maybe, I don't know. So I thought I would try out this cleansing balm. This actually came in a pack of three. I also got some Misfit protein bars. I've heard a lot of really good things about these. These are vegan and gluten-free, low in sugar, and they sound amazing. Sometimes I want something sweet, and I've also been focused on increasing my protein intake since I am now on my fit girl journey. Now get back on my workout routine, building muscle and these sounded really good. So this is just like a little variety pack. I have no idea how these are, but I will let you know when I try. We shall see. Speaking of food, I also am well aware that my Califia Farms Barista Blend Oat Milk that I truly love so much has oil in it. And you know, oil's fine. My skin just doesn't do well with a bunch of oil. So I thought I would give this oat milk a try. Super clean ingredients. It's literally just filtered water, organic whole grain oats, and vanilla extract. There's no oil in this. I'm just trying to do all the things to keep my skin clear and healthy. My skin has been a lot better lately, but I'm just trying to eliminate certain triggers for my skin where I can. Figured this is an easy swap. We'll see how this is. I'm definitely not gonna eliminate all oil from my diet. <laughs> and you know, I'm still consuming things that are processed, but I'm just trying to think of small, easy swaps that I can make that may not make a big difference in taste and could decrease my chances of breaking out, et cetera, et cetera. Okay, now I am actually really hungry, but wait, let me show you my new pajamas that I was telling you about that match the dog's sweaters that I got. So as I showed you, I got these little green Christmas sweaters for the dogs, which are so cute. And I got them because I got these holiday jammies from Victoria's Secret. I have not tried them on yet, but I thought they were really cute. I love the green, They're like comfy, stretchy thermal. And I got my mom a pair too. And I was like, um, hello, the dogs can kind of match. That is adorable. I do feel kind of weird wearing festive pajamas this early, but I mean, it's vlogmas day one. So we just got it, we, we're, we're going all out, you know, YOLO. Here is dinner, just have some jasmine rice, tofu, sauteed kale, spicy green sauce from Jack's Wife Frida, and some sauerkraut. Put the girls in their sweaters, they look so cute. And look how festive the house looks. I'm so happy with how everything turned out. Like it looks so cute in here. By the way, I love the jammies. They are so comfortable. This is my favorite holiday movie of all time. I watch it like a hundred times every year. Okay, I'm eating the salad too. <laughs> I'm still hungry. I'm not surprised though. Just a Greek salad. Oh my gosh, just tried the cookies and cream bar. Unbelievable, so, so good. I'm gonna sign off now guys. Sorry, I don't have a bra on. <laughs> but I love you and I will see you tomorrow.